Billy Link. Lee Anderson. Thank you, Mr Deputy Speaker. COVID has changed the way we live and work. We've all had to adapt and our NHS has been forced to find better ways of working. So can my right honourable friend please reassure me that our NHS will learn from our COVID days, adopt some of the new measures in place and improve its performance over the coming years whilst delivering on our commitment to recruit 50,000 more nurses and build 40 new hospitals. Absolutely. We are on track to, uh, to hire 50,000 more nurses over this parliament and to build uh, 40 new hospitals over this decade. Uh, they are absolutely core commitments in our manifesto that he and I both uh, stood on with great enthusiasm uh, and I look forward to delivering on those uh, commitments. Um, and, the, uh, and, and the white paper will help towards that, but that is on, uh, on track and underway already. Um, he, he's quite right about learning from what's gone well in the pandemic, where the NHS has had to work so incredibly hard. Um, this, the white paper will help to do that. But it's also critical that some of the culture and some of the ways of working, which has been more flexible, more dynamic, and more joined up within the NHS over this past year, embracing more modern technology than ever before. It's critical we keep pushing that culture forward and supporting people in driving that culture forward uh, and don't fall back to old ways of, uh, of working. The white paper will help us to do that, but it's only one part because it's really down to how everybody works as a team and works together, uh, which is at the core of where things have gone well over the pandemic.